What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. So today I'm going to be hopping on Silver Ridge Peaks and I'm finally bringing out the 338. I did bring the 7 mil and I did bring the 22. So let's start off with the 338. I got a couple of bull elk out there. I got two level 3s. This guy's giving me a broadside. I don't think I'm going to get a follow up. Ooh, that was a little risky for that shot. But his health is dropping, so maybe I did hit something solid? Perhaps vertebrae, maybe intestines, I'm not too sure. And here's my second bull elk that I actually took a shot on. So I actually got a left lung at 218 yards. My other bull is piled up here. I shot him with a 338. Should have got a double lung. He didn't run very far. In fact, I did got a double lung at 223. Now, coming to another location, got a level 3 bull, and I got a level 4 bull with a max weight estimate. So let's go get on him, and let's change it up. Let's use the 7 mil. Actually, let's just double check the range so I don't mess up. At about the same distance as the last zone. Now let's get on this level 4 before he turns. That should take him down, and he's going to flee. Question is, am I going to get a shot? There's the level 4 just piled up. He's probably getting out there in range. I came in contact. Uh, probably not the best kind of shot. His health is not dropping, so I'm assuming I did not get a vital. As for my level 4 bull, let's pick him up. So, 219 yards. I did manage to pull off a double lung. Kind of shot him on an angle, but still managed to get a double lung. All right, so coming to another location, got a couple level three bulls. Got a level four in that zone over there. Got a two. That there's a two minor. That's not a two minor, is it? I guess it would be. But as I was coming in, spotted out this guy. Level five bull elk, estimate 446 to 533. Now you need a 481 point something for a diamond. So he's definitely diamond potential. So he's 170 out. Let's take him down with the 338. I think I should wait till he puts his head back up. Is that solid? His health is dropping. Nice. That level 4 is alert. Let's take him down with the 7 mil. That should have been solid. His health is dropping. And here's my level 5 bull. Well, let's actually get a screenshot of that. Alright, moment of truth. Is he going to be big enough? In fact, he is. Got a right lung and liver at 171 yards. Scoring 490. 1,019 pounds. Let's save him before I forget about him. And let's get a screenshot. And let's get a close up. beautiful bull.
And here's my level 4. So, got a double lung. At 261 yards. And that one was with the 7 mil. So, this 7 mil is doing a pretty good job on these bull elk. And he's giving me a score of 358. Now, coming to another location before the drinking time for the elk ends. I got a level 3 bull there. Got a level 3 bull there. Now, I'm not too sure if he's going to hear the gunshot, but I'm going to use the 7 mil. He is alert. I think that shot placement was a little low. I was trying to go for the heart. Yeah, I don't think he's going down from that. I didn't realize there was another level 3 bull over there. So let's go ahead and take him down. Let's use a 338. Should have been solid. This health is dropping. As for my first bull, he actually ran in a, in a direction I needed him to. Got a right lung at 172 with a 7 mil. And this guy here, I would have taken down with the 338. So almost 300 yards. And I got a right lung. It is now bison drinking time. So I got a two honor bull. I don't see another bull. So let's just go ahead and take him down. Maybe take down a female. We'll start off with the 338. I did come in contact with that female. I don't think it was good enough, actually. That two minor bull is going down. I saw his health drop. That should take her down. Uh, hopefully. Okay, she should go down from that. I do got a turkey, so let's get on him. and smoke them. As for this guy, this one should be my two minor bison. In fact it is, so I got a left lung at 268 yards. And here's my female bison. So I got intestines and then I got a flesh, so not the greatest shots. Level 6, Black Bear, and that 7 mil is going to knock him down quick. And here's my turkey. So, got a liver and right lung at 203 yards with a 22. And here's my Black Bear. So, 204 yards. Got a right lung and liver with the 7 mil. Now I spawned back at my outpost and decided to come to the other lake. I'll show you where I am. So I took down a couple bison and headed out this way. I spawned back at my outpost and came to this other lake. It is still bison drinking time. These guys I did get alert. Although I don't know where they're headed. Got a two minor there, level three. I do find it weird that they're still walking off. Yeah, it's only nine o'clock. Gonna see if they calm down and come back in. Well, they're not coming back in, but I got another level three further out. 
Almost 350. Let's try the 7 mil. As long as it doesn't turn, I think it's going to about to turn. Now the 7 mil is not going to take them down as fast compared to the 338. His health just started to drop, so I'm assuming that I did get a lung. I just spotted out a couple more bison in the distance. It's about 370 out. I got two level threes, and there's a two minor. Let's try the 338. Uh, don't think I'm gonna get a follow-up. What about this guy? Hopefully I did compensate for that bullet drop. Uh, good enough. His health is dropping. I got him. And this bison here, I believe I took him down with the 7 mil. In fact, it is. And busted through the shoulder blade and I got the left lung at 342 yards. I just came across one of the other bison. This guy I do believe I shot with a 338. Uh, 378 yards. Uh, shoulder blade and right lung. And finally, my last bison. Uh, got a single lung. Got a left lung at 368 yards with a 338. Now, as for the 7 mil. Silver Ridge Peaks, this is where the gun is actually going to shine. Got a pronghorn, he's alert. I'm pretty sure there's a mountain lion around. He's going back to eating. Got a level 2. So in theory, seeing the fact that the class animals here on Silver Ridge Peaks goes from class 4 to 9, you wouldn't really need the bigger caliber, such as the 300 mag or the... 338, but for sure if you're taking down a bison, it would go down a lot quicker if you're using a higher caliber. And if this pronghorn would actually... There we go. That's the 338. Let's not use that. That should take him down. And I don't think I'm going to get a follow-up. And here he is. So, got a left lung at 184 with a 7 mil. So, I advanced the time for the mule deer to come in. I did have a mountain lion around here. I, you can still hear him in the background, or her. The did spook off the bighorn sheep because the bighorn sheep do overlap the drinking time for the mule deer for one hour but I do have a level 3 muley buck and a level 4 I'm just gonna verify the range get a bit more precise definitely want to go for that level 4 first Let's get out the 7 mil. And actually, if they're going to work their way closer to the water... Alright, I'm going to go for the shot. Level 4 is down. Level 3 just piled up. And this guy should be my level 4. Fact it is, got a double lung at 298 yards. Giving me a score of 236. And here's my level 3. Uh, double lung at 320. Giving me a score of 212. 
Now I decided to come to one last lake before I head into the lodge to place my diamond bowl elk. And this is actually a good spot. I'm going to show you quickly. So top of the map, I do have a tent placed. I'm going to have to maybe do a different setup here because my tripod is right out of zone for the mule deer. So basically when I come out here, I got to crawl all the way to my tripod, which they can't see me because it's kind of a hill. But I do have a level 4, which is alert. Don't know if I'm going to get a follow up on another muley buck. That's a decent size 3. But yeah, let's get on this fort before he flees. And I'm not going to react quick enough. And that 4 is down. If they do run that way and slow down, I may get another shot. And it doesn't look like they're slowing down anytime soon. I don't think that was a good shot. Obviously not, I missed. But as for my level 4, got a double lung at 95 yards. Blonde fur type, 271. It's pretty far off for being a diamond. You need a 312. Alright folks, well the clip is coming to an end, so I just placed them in the lodge, giving me a score of 490.6, and I do have another big bull behind them, giving me a score of 491.5, so I find they look pretty nice side by side. So that's going to be a wrap for the clip, so hopefully you all enjoyed me going out on several Ridge Peaks and pretty much ju just going out and do a random hunt, and I'm glad I did. I got myself a diamond with the new uh, weapon, 338. I would like to get a diamond with the 7 mil as well as the 308, so that's something for me to work on. But besides the fact, I find on several Ridge Peaks if you're going to just go out and do a random hunt, in theory, you, you only really need the 7 mil. It's going to co cover most of the species besides the bird. So that's, or the turkey I should say, that's why I brought out the 22. Or if you just want to bring out the 7 mil or the uh, shotgun with the bird shot, you can do that as well. But obviously for the bison and the elk, elk not so much, but mostly the the bison obviously the 338 and the 300 mag is going to take down the bison a lot quicker compared to the 7 mil but the 7 mil is capable of doing it but that's just my opinion it whatever you guys use for your loadouts i mean if it's working for you keep on doing it you don't absolutely have to take my advice i'm just giving you guys my opinions but like i said on that note that's going to be a wrap for those that watch my videos, I really appreciate it. Like and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys all next time.